Across we go to race number two. We remain on the all weather, but the class four step out here over the 1200 metres. Dao Xiao Sing has won three from six on this surface. Moiraki ran second to Lucky Fun at his all weather debut and has a good draw of barrier two. Our striking Mr C is disappointed with his first two runs back. He'll be trying to turn that around. Mighty Power has an all-weather debut in the second race. Magic Supreme does as well. He's drawn Barry number one and his trials have looked good on the surface as well. Demon's Rock had a spin around over 16.50 last start. Didn't run it out. Dropped straight back to the six furlongs. Golden Bite Bolt has had no luck with the draws. And Dollar Reward pacifies again. And he comes back to his preferred surface after his last two on the turf at Happy Valley. Striking Mr C has been up for a freshen up and Multi Power has been to Chung Far too, Tom. Yeah, well, he's likely to be one of the horses going forward to his striking Mr. C, although he wasn't quick out of the gates last time out. He missed it, in fact, and Alfred Chan uh, goes on board, but he was back to his bad old ways too back when he pulled up a, a roar, so still not all sound there with him. Magic Supreme, multi-power, enjoy my life. He's only having his second run, is enjoy my life. You've got dollar reward on that three-wide line there as well of uh, flying around, flying on the turf. He ran better on the surface last uh, couple of runs ago, and uh, more lucky there on the fence as well. Here is flying on the turf, Karis Teton aboard, and he'll ride him on race day as well. So, look, the horse goes nicely on the surface. It's an 800 metre gallop for him, and uh, we we'll see how he does get on on race day. He's had three goes on it before for a placing. Our family folks and Moiraki are the two we're just concentrating on here. It's a partner horse. So, uh, family folks is running in this meeting, but Moiraki's 84, he's closest to us. He goes well, and it was a good run from him on the surface uh, last start for him as well. And Mighty Power, I thought he stretched out nicely here as well, so uh, it wasn't too bad for him coming onto the surface for the first time. He's by power, and we've seen that progeny go pretty well on the surface. Righty, yeah. let's uh, get back to these replays now again, and we're going to start. So I've got a few to look at here. Thou Shall Sings in the first replay. He came back to Class 4 last time and ran third behind the Inform Resolute. He's hard to leave out with his course and distance record is Thou Shall Sing. Three wins from six starts, along with uh, two other minor placings. So he's only missed the top four on uh, one occasion. He did stumble at the start, so there was the odd excuse for him last time out, but uh, I thought he stayed on well enough here, Paul. Behind Resolute, he goes around later. Yeah, I think he's a very consistent horse, isn't he? So, look, he's definitely in for me as well, uh, Thou Shall Sing. He, he's, uh, he, he really likes his surface. Vincent Ho's been aboard for all four of his victories as well and will be on board again in race number two. Moidaki, Demon's Rock and striking Mr C. Can he go on from this all-weather debut, Paul Moidaki? I think he can. Um, I thought it was a, this was a strong race. Um, obviously, that's Resolute, who came out and bolted up last time. And also, um, Lucky Fun, who will be a short price favourite later on in the card. So I thought it was a really good form race behind those two horses. He hit the line strongly. Um, looked at uh, our rockers. We've seen a couple. Lucky Pats has already won on the surface this season. So I think there's no problem with that. And it's out in the mares out of a, a American bred mare as well. So prop Definitely, I think he can. Yeah, nothing wrong with his recent trial as well. He didn't do too much in that uh, trial. He was uh, just quiet at the back and did his own thing, but uh, he's certainly one of the players. Happy Valley, Tom. Dollar reward. He's yet to win at Happy Valley, but he does like racing on the dirt, and he gets that this week. And that run two back at Happy Valley, I thought, had plenty of merit behind Wood on five. Of course, came out and won again on uh, Wednesday night. Zach Purton gets on board uh, with this horse, and uh, he rides... Uh, uh, him for the 13th time. He's got a reasonable record with him as well. And I don't think he's the worst here. In fact, I, I'm going to tip him on top of the pacifiers going back on. He's dropped a little bit of weight coming into this, so I think he'll be tough to beat. Yeah, I agree with you. I've got him as a Quinella horse, actually. So I think he, with Zach coming aboard back onto the surface, there's some real good positives there. Magic Supreme is unknown on this surface too, uh, Paul, but his trials on it have looked very good. This is a second on the 23rd of February. Yeah, so look, I put him in. I, off the back of these trials, I thought his trials have been pretty good. He's by uh, Zoostar, this horse. Uh, Barry number one, he should get a nice run just in behind the pace. And um, look, there's been nothing wrong with him. So yeah, I, I, I think he's a good chance. He was on speed in this uh, recent trial. He hasn't done much overall recently, but I didn't think it was bad last time out. Now, the third horse in that trial was All Best Friends, a winner during uh, the week. And the, the sixth horse in that trial was Everforce, also a winner uh, during the week. It didn't quite sneak him in, but I think there might be some improvement. Can the best hero improve? Tom, he's run second in a trial, but he hasn't done a lot on race day. I'd want to see him do it on race day uh, before uh, he does, uh, before I was to entertain tipping him. He's drawn 12. Wasn't exactly staying on strongly there, Paul. Mighty Power, I didn't mind his trial. He's the horse there in third placing, but I'd be a little bit wary about the best hero the way he's gone to the line there. Yeah, definitely. It was a good 
uh, trial, I thought, from uh, Mighty Power. Now, he is by power, and, and we know that uh, progeny goes well on the surface. He's just drawn 10, and that's why he just failed to get in for me. Wagner Ball just rides for David Hayes on Mighty Power. Your top four, Paul? Yeah, I'm going to stick with Moiraki. I think he comes out of a strong form race, and from his draw, barrier two, he should get a perfect run. Dollar reward, we know he likes the surface. Magic Supreme, on his trials, he should be fine, and thou shall sing for four. Three, eleven, eight, and two. 11, 2, 3 and uh, 1 my numbers. I thought dollar reward with Zach Purton going back on board. Back onto the your weather, he'd be tough to beat pacifiers on. Uh, horse number 11, 2 thou shall sing. Very hard to leave him out with his consistency, course and distance. Uh, Moraki goes in. And the other one I put in was flying on the turf because you go back to class 3, 4 runs ago. He was beaten 5 and a quarter there, but that was by far his uh, best effort here so far behind Zarsan. That would have been a stronger race than what he meets here. So maybe he can figure uh, in this grade. 11, 2, 3 and 1.